He's not going to have free access to the internet. As Beth McGowan watches her four-year-old son play in the park, she knows one day she will have to worry about what information he's giving away on the internet. They're, they're innocent. They can't foresee what the ramifications could be of just the tiniest detail of their life. With Gainesville officials ramping up their investigations on internet predators, Hall County Police say the response from parents has been positive. Uh, they're glad that we're out there doing these types of cases and they're glad that we're getting these kind of people off the street. Well, most of the parents we spoke to said they have some concern because the internet's not only a click away, but it's also in their pockets. Now, parents also said that they will be more strict as their kids get older. As far as just having access to the internet, I, it'll be a long time, I, I, you know, I don't know when, but even for a report for school or something like that, it will be under my supervision for sure. And if you do end up talking to a stranger online, police say to be cautious. Make every effort to, uh, to verify who it is that they're talking to. Um, and, and if there's any doubt whatsoever, just simply disregard the, the transaction, disregard the, the interaction between that person and just move on. Just don't respond to it.